green flag in the air. We're crowned big race in heat race number one. The dog pound, Chandler Barker. He makes quick work of the field down here in turn one. Chandler Barker, your leader off turn two, but here comes King Kong. Bundy Stowe works the outside of Chad Mack. Stowe with a run into three. Gets to the back bumper of Barker. Oh, round goes back in turn one as we go side by side for the lead, but we will go on caution. Harris Speedway, East Lincoln Speedway, Chandler Barker brings it back to the green flag. Chandler Barker out of Drexel, North Carolina. King Kong, Bundy Stowe to the back bumper off turn two. They go side by side for the lead. It's Stowe and Barker. Chandler Barker, the inside, Bundy Stowe making the run on the high side. He's high, wide, and handsome for, oh, contact. Both drivers hold on to it. Chandler back, Chandler Barker back to third now. King Kong, Bundy Stowe now about a five car length lead on second place. Daryl Jordan, the 7M, or excuse me, uh, Billy, Billy Mack. Oh, second place goes around right here on the front straightaway. Caution will come out once again. Second caution of this Crown Vic Heat race number one. Bundy Stowe leads the field back to greens. We got contact going into turn one. That's going to be Mack again along with the one car. Both drivers able to keep it pointed in the right direction. Bundy Stowe, your leader. Chandler Barker runs a close second as they go side by side for third. Behind them, contact with those two drivers. Oh, the 19, Michael Gatton. Hold on to, oh, he's going to go around in front of the field. Everybody misses him. Bobbing and weaving all over the place. Oh, and Mack goes around again in turn one. White flag has been displayed. Checkered flag for Bundy Stowe. Off turn number four, Chandler Barker will finish second. Third will be the 115 of Kai Lucas. I hear you, Kai Lucas. Philip Taylor, Dustin Heiler going to lead the field to green contact already up front. Three wide at the line for the third position. Here comes the zero of TJ Slack from shotgun on the field to second. As they exit turn two, we're going to stack them up. In turn two, we're going to stack them up deep. That's going to be, I believe that's going to be Dustin Heiler and the taxi cab of James Hilton. So this will be our last and final heat race of the evening. Green flag in the air for James Hilton. Hilton, Hyler, oh man, TJ Slack, we got five cars going for the lead. In turn one and two, we're three wide for the lead. We're beating and banging, we're rubbing. We are all over each other out there. And it looks like TJ Slack gonna come to a stop. Dustin Hyler limping as well. Got one off the pace in turn four as well. And I'm sure you can catch all that on BAM racing videos. That was a crazy, crazy first lap. Philip Taylor gonna lead it back to green flag off turn four, green flag in the air for Taylor. Bailey Lofton now up to second position. Philip Taylor, your leader out of Lancaster, South Carolina. gets turned off four.
So Bay. And make it back for tonight's main event. Tough break for the C4. Breaking the right front tie rod while leading off turn four. Green flag in the air for Bailey Lofton. Bailey Lofton leads Daryl Jordan. All right, so at the conclusion of this heat race, we'll go into a short intermission. Short intermission. So we got a super late model going to take some. Adam Yarborough in the 57, going to take a couple of laps in that 57 super late model machine. Yarborough Automotive, sponsor of Carolina Speedway in 2024. 